Hey everyone, welcome back to Lumber Capital Log Yard. We're going to run the mill today and work on our order that we have been trying to get done here. Uh, I spilled gas all over my hand, so I uh, am not liking my situation today because I scrubbed and scrubbed and I still smell like gas. Ugh, hee <laughs> hee, she says. Amy is cutting down the hatchet house boards today. We can take a look sees to see what grandpa's doing. Oh, he's helping a customer. He has quite the mess going on in the office today. I probably won't be able to get a 10 inch out of that next one there, so we'll have to look at my list. So he's going to finish board and battening that section right there today. And that will finish that section up. I don't think that this next log is going to get a 10 inch wide board out of it. Uh, that has been my main focus because we need like over 300 of them. But there's a lot of other things we can work on that's in the order, including wavy edge, which I know I mentioned yesterday. So I might be doing that out of this log or two by fours. I guess I could do two by sixes too, but I'd rather do two by sixes out of a log that I could get 12 inches out of, so then I could just cut them in half. We'll see here, have to measure. Because it looks a little longer than whole feet. What is it? Okay, so this log is actually 14 feet. All right, looks like we're actually going to be cutting two biceps out of this one. I would rather not, just because of the size of it. Just doesn't really make much sense, but we have to use the logs that we have for this order, so it is what it is.
We are putting all of the lumber for that order on the ground instead of putting it on the trailer like we normally would so that we can pick it up at the forks. The tractor can't handle a lot so we're putting dunnage down in between every few stacks so that we can take more than one trip and it's not too heavy for the tractor. We had a blade snap on us and this is what it looks like. Not too pretty. Doesn't always jam like this quite as bad, but this time it really, really came out of there. The nozzle for the lubricant system has been clogged up, so this happens once in a while and I just have to take it off. Then I usually keep a little, oh here it is, paper clip, bent paper clip here that I used to unjam it. And then I usually just wash it out to make sure that all that sawdust is out of there. It's three, so we need a few more logs to finish up the day, so mom is over there loading with the gravel. That's it for today's video. Ruining the party. We're not putting the kaboot away. Well, I'm not. We should probably put the kaboot away before we leave. No, I think we need to. Okay. Well, I'm talking to the fans, so you're Welcome gonna have to do it. to Lumber Capital Log Yard. <laughs> put the kaboot away. Anyways, that's it for today's video. Remember to like and subscribe and turn on that notification bell so you don't miss out on another video and I'll see you next time.